From Interior Alaska's most trusted news source, this is your morning news update with J.R. Lewis. Good morning and thanks for joining us. It's Monday, July 7th, 2014. In the news, Fairbanks police say a vehicle hit a utility pole in downtown Fairbanks over the weekend, knocking out power in the area. AP reports the vehicle reportedly struck several other vehicles Saturday night before crashing through barricades and running into the power pole. Police say the driver and passenger were transported to Fairbanks Memorial Hospital. A Healy man will serve one year in jail for beating another man with a baseball bat in an apparent case of mistaken identity. AP reports Joshua Sanford must also pay his victim's medical bills. Sanford was arrested in October after the beating. According to court documents, the victim had fallen asleep at a friend's house, woke up to the sound of a revving vehicle, and was then hit on the head when he went outside. A witness told authorities Sanford then apologized to the victim, saying that he was not who he thought he was. Attorneys on both sides said Sanford had legitimate motivation for attempting to beat his real target. And authorities in Fairbanks are seeking information about a moose killing. Alaska wildlife troopers say a moose was found shot and left to rot in the backyard of a North Pole residence. The troopers say the moose was likely shot with a rifle in the vicinity of the Christine Drive, Rep Road and Brock Road area within the past few days. AP reports the carcass was discovered on Thursday. Anyone with information is asked to call Alaska Fish and Wildlife Safeguard at 800-478-3377 or local Alaska wildlife troopers at 451-5348. A quick look at the Fairbanks weather. Flood advisory for the Chena River near North Pole until 515 this afternoon. Forecast for today, tonight and tomorrow is cloudy with scattered showers, isolated thunderstorms, highs in the 70s and lows in the 50s. Extended forecast, not much change till Friday night, then it might clear up a little. 70s through Wednesday, 60s on Thursday, low 70s again Friday and Saturday. That's all we have for right now. Glad you could join us. And remember, if you want more news, sports, or weather, download our free mobile app for Android and Apple devices. From all of us at News Center 11, I'm J.R. Lewis. Thanks for watching.